We're in Italy at one of the most important and prestigious gathering of classic cars, the Gran Premio Nuvolari, named after Italian racing legend Tazio Nuvolari. For more than 20 years, Eberhard, the brand known for its innovative chronograph, has been a partner of this famous event where time really matters. Over three days, 250 participants will drive 1,000 kilometers in the beautiful Italian scenery, where the name of the game is not going the fastest, but is having the most precise average time. Between two marks, the driver and his co-pilot will have to manage this distance within a pretty fine time set by the racing officials. And the crew nearest to that precise time will obviously be the winner. Over these three days, there will be approximately 80 timed segments and the overall winner will have a difference of approximately one hundredth of a second between those predetermined time and what he will achieve. The first leg of the itinerary will take participants from Mantova to Rimini, but going through legendary places like the famous racing circuit of Modena and especially Imola. The second leg is the most demanding both for the crews and their machines and will go through the mountain hills of Tuscany. And finally, for the third leg, participants will come back from Rimini back to Mantova. So let's go and talk with some of these drivers. So how did this race go for you? Very good, very good. And uh, the special is the beautiful weather. There's more social event, there's competition and, uh, and beautiful cars, a lot of old cars. So, there were three magnificent days. Oh, fantastic. We really liked it a lot. It was a lot of fun. It was a bit tired. Everyone a bit tired now. It was absolutely wonderful. Beautiful weather, wonderful people that came out to support and the organizers here have got everything just perfectly done so that there was no problem, no difficulties. And the car went well, so what more can one ask for? And what about yourself? How did you enjoy this? It was really fun and I really liked it. Yeah. Was it the first time for you? Yes. And you're looking forward to doing a second time then? Yes. <laughs> did you have any worries with your car? No, not at all. A little bit of heating of the, of the motor and myself. <laughs> no, it always makes a good story, but I'm afraid to say she had no problems whatsoever. She was just a good girl. I'm proud of the car, you know. I drove the Mille Miglia this year, no problem. I drove the Nuvolari this year, no problem. So I was a little bit um, uh, warm sometimes, the engine, but overall, fantastic. The car uh, was uh, running very well and very fast. We are very happy with the car. It was perfect. It's a Talbot 105. It uh, has three liters. It's from 1934, and uh, it has 160, 170 horsepower. So it's really, really quick, and it's great fun to drive. It is a Bentley. Yeah? It is the fastest lorry in the world. <laughs> <laughs> How fast does it go exactly? This one is, uh, I think, 180 uh, kilometers an hour. Oh, yeah, that is fast. Eight, eight liter, 200 horsep horsepower. He's doing very well, very well. Good car. It is a Jaguar SS100 from uh, 38, a two and a half liter. Did you prepare it very specifically for this race? Or? Yeah, it's a Brooklyn Super 7, so it, it was made for racing. So it's uh, just uh, the normal specification, but of course before you go 1,100 kilometers, you, uh, you check the brakes and you, you ch change the oil and you look everything. Yeah. We are not professionals, we just have normal watches and you know we don't have so much technique in the car but we, we love it anyway. Italy is great. And it is hard to beat the Italian and hard to beat the Argentina people. The Italian they are so good. There's some really good competitors here yeah. and so um, I, we're fairly new to this so I don't think we're going to be too high but you know if we're second to bottom it's alright isn't it? <laughs> it was very nice. I think we, have, we will have a ranking among the first 50s. And it's good, I think it's good. For me it's good, I don't know for him, but... <laughs> <laughs> for the team it's very good, because the team uh, uh, probably will have around seven cars among the first 20. Ladies will win, so very, very good result. What souvenir will you keep of this uh, incredible race? The surrounding, I mean, you, 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 you drive 1,000 kilometers around Italy, uh, hills, mountains, flats, lowlands, 
people around uh, clapping in its hands. Very nice. This is the, the the most beautiful memory. And are you a bit tired now? No, 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 no. I have to go out for dinner, so I, I have to be fit. Okay. <laughs>